This is the, the final race of the day, the National Hunt Chase, just run through the market. OK Corral, 100 to 30. Bally Ward, 4 to 1. Champagne Classic, 8 to 1. Discorama, 12 to 1. Impulsive Star, 14 to 1. Delta Work, who of course we, we doubt will run in the race at 16s. Mr Malarkey at 16s. Um, Mortal, as you mentioned, 20 to 1 and uh, 20 to 1 bar. My only problem with, with OK Corral, I almost think he's too good or too yeah. fast to get the four mm. miles. I mean, look, if you're on a big price, it's great. You're in a lovely position. You could, you could almost lay him back now and just have a free bet. Um, I certainly wouldn't want to be backing him at three to one because I think four miles is going to might just find him out. I mean, he clocked a fantastic time when he won at Warwick. He looked a really good operator that day. Um, that three mile race is quicker than the two mile race in the last circuit. I'm thinking how this horse can keep that pace up for for four miles, and they do go a good clip in this. Mm. Whereas Bally Ward looks an absolute absolute out and out stay, stay doesn't he? Yeah. Along with Discarama, I put Discarama up that day. Yeah. I don't know if you remember when he he come there looming up alongside. Um, I don't think that was a foregone conclusion. Absolutely that day not. I, I I thought he was he was throwing down a big challenge, and he, he took a while to warm up as well that day. Disco Ram. He was a bit sketchy early on, but once he got into top gear, he absolutely flew home. Um, I also rate Disco Ram. I have ever since he won his, his maiden his maiden chase. So I still think chuckle at his maiden hurdle win at Fairy House last year. Sorry, I still chuckle at his maiden hurdle win at Fairy House. <laughs> he's, yeah, he's. I mean, he's he's got a bun, He's got a huge he's amount. Of and Paul Nolan has had a really good season as well yeah. under the radar. He's coming back into the big time. Um, and I think Disco Rama has got a good chance of putting him back on the map. But I, I think those two out of that, that chase that Bally Ward won last time, the forms worked out, Chris's Dream and uh, Champagne Classic were first and second next time out in the 10 up. It's hard to knock. And they, they, like I said, I think they look more uh, copper bottom stayers than OK Corral, who I think wouldn't be the first horse to go there with a really sexy profile and not quite get home. I mean, it found out Native River, didn't it, in the yeah. end? So yeah. <laughs> he won a gold cup. and. I, I, I think Al Corral should be in the, the three mile race. I think he'd probably win that. Yeah. So.